Okay. Here we are. I think, uh... Part one was horrible, so I actually mean to make progress this time. I told you my sister would help us out. I'm going to rest up here a while before heading to Windhelm. So you saw a dragon, did you? Tell me, what was it like? As big as a house? Well, I'll be. That would be a sight to see. Uh, not that I actually want I'm to see cold, it. so it's making me sit out in the I cold. That dragon stays far away from here. Not mean to do that. I'm glad to help any way I can. Jarl Balgruf? I don't mean to be disrespectful as he's ruled White Run Hold well for years, but he seems in over his head now. He's been trying to stay out of the war, but it can't last. He's going to have to pick a side. I'm afraid he's going to make the wrong choice. I wouldn't say that. But he and Ulfric have been at odds for years, and I'm afraid Balgruf will end up siding with the Empire because of it. But it's hard to believe that even Balgruf would choose Elisif over Ulfric. Of course, Ulfric's cause is just. It's time for Skyrim to rid itself of the Empire. The Empire may have been good for Skyrim once upon a time, but those days are long past. Banning the worship of Talos was the last straw. Thalmor everywhere! Dragging people off for honoring our own gods. I'm glad Raylof is helping drive them out of here. If I was a bit younger, I might have joined the fight myself. <laughs> I suppose she's Jarl Elisif now. She married High King Turig just before Ulfric killed him. The Empire supports her claim to be High Queen. I don't really have anything against her. Not her fault that her husband Turig was bought and paid for by the Empire. But she's nothing but a puppet for the Empire now, with her husband Turig dead. Ulfric will make sure she never takes the throne as High Queen. Some say murdered, but it was a lawful challenge in the old way. Ulfric called him out as a traitor to Skyrim, and killed him in single combat. If Turig couldn't defend his throne, he had no business being High King. No, not until the Moot meets to choose another, and it won't meet until one side or the other wins the war. Don't worry, though. Ulfric is our rightful High King. He'll drive out the Empire, and Skyrim will have peace at last. It's my meal. Some folks think it's my town, too, but it ain't. The Jarl in Whiterun owns the land and the town. I just pay the taxes. And by supplies, I suppose you mean weapons and armor? Alvor can help you out. He's our blacksmith. Be careful out there.
the freaks this I did not pick up firewood and it put me in third person I didn't mean to take that What? I got too straw. <laughs> what the freak? Make yourself at home. Yeah, I'm definitely uh, not taking anything. Our character's hungry and tired, and this guy just took my bed. I want to sleep with her. Alright, uh, food. Where's that seared? Slaughterfish. Boom. Level up? Nope. It's ten. Two hours is twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight a.m. Was there a mod that made you sleep faster? <laughs> and that is not. Oh, it is eight a.m. Okay. Okay, hey, my inventory. I have a decent amount of space. Let's see, what do I not need on me? Actually, I can just go sell this stuff. Tell me, son, any truth to these stories I've been hearing about you gluing a cow's others shut? You really what the freak? Something like that? Yeah. So. See, now that's what I'm talking about. Working hard, making your mark on this world. Good job, son. Huh, that ain't nothing. Wait till you see what I got planned for next week. That is not good encouragement. That cow is suffering. Keep your eyes open. Or anything in here? Can I cook in here? Yeah. Might as well start cooking. Cooking puzzle allows you to cook food that restores your health and provides other temporary effects. Each recipe requires specific culinary ingredients to be found throughout Skyrim. Let's misc poison stuff. So I can make. Mm, what seems to be the best? Potato, apple. Is there anything else? Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff I can cook. Okay. 
I just make as much as I can because if I kind of be freaking constantly hungry, I might as well uh, have food to not be hungry. Let's keep sending me to third person. Okay, so from here, make sure uh, survival. Oh, it's on our. Okay, I'll increase the difficulty to. Oh, yeah, expert. <laughs> I don't know how much different Master and Legendary is. Oh, yeah, expert for now. I didn't even know you could change your uh, difficulty. Because I know in uh, Fallout 4, survival mode is its own difficulty. Why is there a person named Taylor Javoch or something on Twitch? And why is her channel recommended to me? Alright, so isn't this the shop? Yeah. Well, one of us has to do something. I said no! No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? I... I'm done you? talking about Back off. this. That. Five bounty. Close enough. How? How do they see me? How am I detected? Oh, no, I'm not. What? Before he comes up here. Yeah, that's great. Am I sitting? What the freak? Hey man, uh, what is happening? Something's wrong. <laughs> what? What are you doing that for? Okay, that was weird. Well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. Uh, yeah, we we did have a bit of a, a break in. We still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. An ornament. Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. You could? I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. Now, if you're going to get those thieves, you... The sooner you find the... Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Items above the divider line belong to the vendor. Items below the white line belong to you. You can buy and sell. Alright, what is the idea of? Small leather tent and bedroll. Okay. This is all his stuff. Misc.
I want to buy this tent just because it's a thing. And also, I'm pretty sure it'll help me camp on the road. How's a fishing rod a weapon? I mean, I guess... Regenerate 25. Okay, let me sell some stuff first. I think this is two-handed. have enough to uh I'm by extra carrying capacity. <laughs> I won't have enough to get that. Holy expensive. This is crazy. I think I have a few old spell books laying about. If you want more, you'll have to go to the College of Winterhold. Hmm. Till next time. So this is your plan, Lucan? Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Uh, no, I... By the eight, fine. But only to the edge of town. We have to go through town and across the bridge to get to Bleak Falls Barrow. You can see it from here, though. The mountain just over the buildings. Those thieves must be mad hiding out there. Those old crypts are filled with... Nothing but traps, trolls, and who knows what else. they only stole Lucan's golden claw. I mean, we have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. Lucan found the claw about a year after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. He's a tricky one. This is the bridge out of town. 
The path up the mountain to the northwest leads to Bleak Falls. Ba huh? <laughs> Mara bless you for agreeing to help. Well, it's a winding road up the mountain just ahead. You'll know you're in the right place once you spot the old watchtower. Once you get to the tower, head north. Bleak Falls Barrow should be just around the corner further up. Good luck. Lucan and I will be waiting for you back in the shop. What the? Um, it's pretty chill. I just started and played left like an hour yesterday. I had to get off because uh, some people wanted me to play another game. Uh, I don't really know. There's like probably like 50 mods installed, but they're not like game breaking mods, so I can actually have a enjoyable playthrough. Some of them are just the uh, basics, like the uh, unofficial patch and stuff like that. And graphic enhancements. Oh yeah, I do. Yeah, fortunately though, uh, Xbox doesn't get a bunch of the like, really cool mods. 
It's more of a uh, forgotten concept. You gotta wait for everybody to freaking port mods over. But at least I get them, I guess. Gotta be thankful for something. All right, out of the cold. Oh yeah, that'd be cool. It's basically like you have to play with mods to uh, enjoy the game nowadays because the base game is very barren without the uh, creators club and whatever mods. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wait, this is surprise. Yeah. Oh, that was anticlimactic. 
Oh my gosh, this guy has a lot of health. True Nords never back down. It's not <laughs> Alright. Oh, uh, realistically, this is like my very first playthrough because I never really like past white run, so I just collect everything really. And since it's survival mode, we'll have to freaking uh put some back or put some in the chest. Why? Am I missing something? I'm confused. <laughs> Shouldn't it be snake, snake, fish, whatever that thing is. That's amazing. Very fulfilling life. They like glitched or something. clue about any of that so it's gonna be a uh, lore hunt for me Okay, wrong 
side. Quite the battle. Don't let it get me. Help. I don't know if I have enough health to even take a hit from this thing. Entertaining fight. Help me, help. <laughs> Get me down! Get me down! You did it! You killed it! Now cut me down before anything else shows up. Yes, the claw. I know how it works. The claw, the markings, the door in the hall of stories. I know how they all fit okay. together. Help me down, and I'll show you. You won't believe the power the Nords have hidden there. Does it look like I can move? You have to cut me down first. You, over here. It's coming loose. I can feel it. You fool. Why should I yep. share the treasure with anyone? I don't know why this music is still going. <laughs> that boss battle ended like seven minutes ago. Actually, I haven't saved in a while. Let me just save. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Of course there's like a backwards dodge. What the? Oh my god, I was reading chat. That works. I died in one hit. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was great. Let's try this again. that easy. <laughs> that doesn't even uh, sound nice. Imagine though. Isn't 
Panther, uh, yeah, trap. That is not a dead person. What the freak? Okay. What are you doing? Battle of Fire and Ice? I'm dead. <laughs> Potions. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That sounds almost as bad as Fallout 4 survival mode, where if you don't save, you lose all your progress. If you don't go to sleep. I mean, I would enjoy that though. Because, uh. Yeah, this, this is very bland. But, um. I would enjoy a uh, hardcore type once I, uh, you know, get better. Is that a uh, mod on Xbox? Or is it just PC? That just saved me. <laughs> I mean, I like a challenge though, so just having that in the back of your head, if you die, you lose everything. Like, I feel like that would be fun. Even though I already died once. And it would definitely be hard on survival mode because you can only level up if you freaking go to sleep, so. Oh. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> this is going to take a while. Or not. I, I lost a lockpick for one gold and one soldier. Okay. Or two. I'm dead. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Alright, where's my health? I need health. Uh, I have no regeneration potions. This is my last potion. I'll save. And then I already know there's going to be a fight here. I knew it. Swing. So a decent weight. Yeah, I have the uh mod with the uh pouches too, so I can have extra carry weight, because I remember the first time I played survival mode back then, I had no um, that felt great. I had no freaking inventory space. Uh, that makes sense. There's a mod I wanted to get, but uh, 
it was only for the anniversary edition, sadly, so. I might get it eventually, maybe. <laughs> It's uh, these right here, and there's uh, better ones that I can get. I think most of them come from the tannery station in the, um, yeah, that one. I need freaking health. Well, that's one thing about Xbox. It's uh kind of hard to find uh, certain mods. Even if you look up the specific name, you still won't find it. I had to go through the top-rated list like 18 times just to find specific mods. So. <laughs> yeah, it is kind of like same. That's why computer is easier because there's other means of downloading besides just one mod platform. Oh my! I can't move. I thought I just died.
Um, I'm dying here. This guy has too much health. Maybe not. that's coming up. I might die against him. <laughs> oh, oh, I appreciate it. I mean, I only really stream for a... Uh, VOD so I can just upload to YouTube. I mean like if I'm gonna stream might as well upload it I guess. that puzzle coming up, right? Oh yeah, this is the fight. I remember this. He hit me! I've in a health. I don't need cold resistance, I need health. I'm dead. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Maybe I should start using the bow and arrow. survived I'll save all right I don't want to hear this heartbeat so I'm just eat some food Was that? Okay. It's just moth. Oh, what that is wings. Same. 
I had a PC, but my freaking motherboard blew out. <clears throat> so, it wasn't even really like high end, it was more like beginner. So, I'm probably just gonna save for a new one. this in the past. I'm so surprised. <laughs> no, that's fine, I, I appreciate the hope. This looks like another freaking fight. Oh wait, no, there's just one down there. <laughs> yeah, that's how I figured out the first time and just I was stuck in that room for a while and I just observed everything. And then it's just cold right there. I do not think I have I literally cannot take a hit from this guy. It gave me every potion except the one I need. I'll put that on. Yeah, that's everything here. I'll save one more time. Actually, I should probably save right here. That way I don't get spawn killed. Is alright, it's about the same. Run! <sighs> Why is he taunting me? What is that? That's excellent tracking. I literally can't take a hit. <laughs> oh, he's stuck. Or, um... 
Hope I don't regret this. I, I can only take two more hits. Two more screams. We should die here. Nice. Yeah, I, I saw that. Look at that. I am almost in, over encumbered. How do I get rid of it? I just <laughs> sleep it off. I gotta find a potion. Also, oh, one handed, nice. my first time playing so I have no idea what I'm doing. I know there's like certain builds and stuff you can make and I remember the first time I played I was trying to level up my uh, destruction a lot and stuff with the fire. I was fighting mammoths and having to cheese them for like half an hour. Yeah true. your max health points. Alright. <laughs> yeah, I found that out. Oh gosh, I'm cold. Alright, um... The air is treacherously cold. Yeah, that's where I gotta go. Kind of looks like Elden Ring. Actually, it looks exactly like Elden Ring. What the freak? Alright, I'll keep that in mind. I'm just a poor old woman, dear. No need to trouble yourself with me. It's tough just scraping by out here, but I make do. <coughs> I don't know what familiar summons are but yeah I'll, I'll keep what you're saying in mind I did not mean to steal that wait I can sleep here right it's freaking level up here oh never mind it's 
Stop looking at me. Alright, I'm gonna get out of here. Oh my gosh, why does he have so much health? books on drop See what else I can drop. Goodbye, loot that I could have sold. That's what I was trying to do. <laughs> Won't we'll be able to turn this in right now. Oh, it's still open. Hmm. You're back from Bleak Falls. You found it. <laughs> there it is. Strange. It seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Funny thing, huh? <laughs> I'm gonna put this back where it belongs. I'll I'll never forget this. You've done a great thing for me and my sister. Nice. Yeah, I um I tried to jump across, but no jumping happened. <laughs> How much health? Yeah, that would have been bad if I had like zero health. Alright, let me freaking level up finally. I think it's part of a mod I have for the Khajiit. I got health. Oh. Okay. Perks to increase too.
Uh, that would be good. <laughs> yeah, I have a followers mod on. There's actually a guy... What's his name? Like, Inigo? Or something? And I was supposed to go find him to be my first follower. But I need, I forgot where he even, like, spawned at. Before I commit to this, let me... Oh, well, that's crazy. <laughs> okay, there is a block stat. I knew it. Oh, yeah, I see. That's pretty cool. Five more levels in conjuration. That's crazy. If I would have killed one more thing, I could have leveled up again. That's racking. So this is just like automatic spawning. Dead tide. Ooh. Yeah, that's one thing I do like about games is that you can, like, when you have many builds, you can, like, be a summoner, but sad things are, like, in Terraria, there's, like, no summoning things. You have to download external mods to freaking actually have fun and have, be a summoner. Yeah, there's a whole freaking skill tree just for summoning. That's crazy. <laughs> what? That's a crazy school. Oh, since I'm using fire now, I'm just use this on combustion, and then after I level up again. Try to upgrade conjuration. What is a bone altar? Is that like bones that I could just pick up so I can conjure more skeletons? Trying to look at shocked for life or shocked to life, and I can't reach it. That's Puppet Master. Oh, 
okay. Yeah. That's pretty cool. That's gonna be a while. Said alteration. Huh. Oh, I had it. <laughs> it's so hard to select. There, finally. Oh. Yeah, those are cool. Yeah, those, those two seem really useful to have. Wait, I have perk points still? I did not start up perk points.
the sawmill handle them? Papa says I'm too friendly with strangers. But you seem alright. Why does this guy, he was open at 3 a.m., but he's not open now. Ain't whatever you need. Yes, actually. How about you smith me an iron dagger? Here's everything you need to make one. Go ahead. I see no harm in it, if you have the skill. The grindstone will improve your weapons. Use the table to improve your armor. If you've got the raw materials, you can use the forge to make something new. The finest weapons and armor. Hmm. Yeah, I, I do. There's a lot more. What does it say? Like, it added like 437 more perks. That seems like a fun place though. It's just, it might be a little bit more complex on uh, Xbox. Parts ready yet. I can only have I did not know she's right there. They don't have to be perfect. Just send them over when they're ready. Eight firewood added. Travel cloak for a lap. That is expensive. That is a lot of storage. Arch leather tent and bedroll.
That's a decent weapon you've made there. Not bad, but it's a little dull. How about you sharpen it up? Just need a bit of metal and the grindstone over there. All right, then. Do you want to pay me back for this? There's one extra damage. Making me use my... I st nope. You looking for a new blade? This looks good. You put time into your blades. They'll serve you well when you need them. You want to keep helping? How about you make some armor? Let's start by tanning some leather on the rack. Mm-hmm. <laughs> ah, good. A lot of weapons and armor need leather for straps, fittings, that kind of thing. Let's see if you can make a hide helmet. Here's the rest of what you need. Okay, you didn't give me so I... nice. You see, leather helmet? Or hide helmet? I don't remember. <laughs> Hide. What? Huh. I should hire you to be my assistant at this rate. Let's improve the fit. Take this leather to the workbench over there. Until next time. that part of the quest? Yeah, okay. One extra armor. You looking for a new... You have talent. Keep working at your craft, and you'll be a fine smith one day. Really? Why don't you keep that dagger and helmet? Maybe you'll remember me when you're making Skyforge steel, huh? Well, that's rude. Is this guy open yet? Yeah. Thank. Some may call this junk. Me, I call them treasures. I'm sorry, but I gotta sell it. <laughs> My finger slipped. I think uh I think the trader stole it from me.
Uh, is it worth buying that first house in uh, White Run after you do the mission for the Yarl? Because I, I was going to buy it like the first time I played this game and I just never got back on. All right then. Okay. What? Okay. <laughs> there was not a freaking fish there. Yeah, for real. I was gonna say I got cooked rabbit, but no. Nah. One game I can't wait for though is uh, Starfield in September. It's been a long time since uh, it's been a big game like that. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Wait. Oh. I was so confused. You handle yourself well. You could make for a decent shield, brother. An outsider, eh? Never heard of the companions? An yeah, order for of warriors. These days, are games are either trash or they are in production for 12 years. If the coin is good enough. Not for me to say. You'll have to talk to Codlac Whitemane up in Yurvaskar. The old man's got a good sense for people. He can look in your eyes and tell your <laughs> worth. If you go to him, good luck. Have you played the, uh, DLCs? Not DLCs, but the mods that basically are DLCs. Like the, was it Barmuth and the, uh, Frost something? Forgotten City. Ismir, it's true. A jester, funny suit and all. Just north by the Loria's farm. Fool had a coffin and a cart with a broken wheel. 
Well, sounds like you've had quite the journey, Uthka. <laughs> but you were gone longer than usual. I got to thinking maybe you weren't coming back. You sound like my ma. Figured I was lying dead in a field somewhere, is that it? Thought did cross my mind, yeah. War brewing, talk of a riot in Helgen, at Mount Jester's. Skyrim's gone mad, girl. You need to be careful out there. Careful, huh? Thanks, Skullbar. I'll remember that. <laughs> yeah, right. Need something? Yeah, finally stop talking. None of them's older than nine, and the youngest is six. Now the horse I got for sale is seven years old, but in fine health. She's got a lot of spirit, that one. We've taken to calling her Queen Alfsiger, or just Ali for short. I expect you can name her anything you like, once she's yours. Suppose so. Got one all settled if you've got the coin. A thousand gold. Ride strong. <laughs> what the freak? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yo. <laughs> what? Wait. Oh my, it's not even... <laughs> her freaking nipple isn't even covered by her freaking bikini strap. Come on, bro. <laughs> yeah? I'm all ears. Well, what? Where am I? Mm, my head. Bruh. Oh, it's you. Oh my god. I mean, what? No, I've never seen you before. I have no idea who you are. It's not like I've been stalking you or anything. Wait. Don't leave. I I'm injured. Uh, yes, injured. You have to take me with you. Otherwise, I might die, and you wouldn't want that on your conscience. Yeah, well, that's because... Okay, fine. If you take me with you, I will make it worth your while. You won't find anyone tougher than me in Skyrim. Not to mention as good looking. You mean good looking, you're all basically naked. Haha, <laughs> 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 you are so funny. I'm just being honest, and anyone who says otherwise is clearly <laughs> jealous. Can you name someone better than me? <laughs> I didn't think so. Anyway, thanks, I guess. I mean, I don't even know who you are. <laughs> You're so tough and independent why you knew my old. <laughs> what? Ugh, I have no idea. My memory is a little fuzzy. If you happen to have any, I would appreciate it. Oh, and stop staring at my body. It's I'm like not. I've never seen a semi-naked woman before. Of course I'm alright. Don't start fuzzing over me. I'm more than capable of handling myself. I don't. I thought I would help you out. Well, I was hoping you would kind of keep me company. Look, I know it sounds weird, but it's no fun on my own. You can tell me to leave if you want, but surely you can at least give me a chance? Am I not allowed out on my own now? I had a little too much to drink. So what? I guess I must have passed out. I hope I didn't cause too much trouble. Actually, I'm not really that bothered. I don't know. I'll just go wherever you are going. I will repay your kindness by fighting alongside you. Surely that's an offer you can't refuse. Bro, imagine she dies oh, during first. I hey! Myself, have I? <laughs> My name is Sophia, but you probably already knew that. I'm quite well known in Skyrim, although sometimes I'm not sure if it's for the right reasons. I kind of see myself as an adventurer, although it's no fun without anyone to witness my heroic deeds. just force me to as... look at her again. Well, I'm sure there's probably something. I like to get drunk, kill stuff, and be a nuisance. So, what about you? Oh, 
Nice Broderick. to meet you. I hope to be of some use to you. I'm rather talented if I say so myself, so I'm sure there must be something I can do for you. Just let me know. Imagine we talk this whole time and So you're off to see the Yall of White Run then? They wouldn't let me into Dragon's Reach. Apparently, I didn't say follow me. Enough. But with you, I might get away with it. As long as they don't remember that incident when a criminal escaped because I was. Can I. Do I have clothes, man? <laughs> Where's apparel? Um. A chest piece. I could. I can give her fur armor. That'll work. And a helmet. Distracting the guards. Oh my gosh, bro. Where are this? If you say so. Wait. Okay. Put this on. Did I just put it on me? A uh, store. Um, so you can have the shield and the helmet. I have no undergarments or pants for her. Okay, so yeah, if I press equip, it puts it on me. Or not. Okay. If you say so. Is it in my inventory? Okay, it is. I just press store then. There. That's so much better. Yeah, I only download this mod for an extra companion I guess to get early even though there's one literally like as soon as I <laughs> defeat the dragon same relationship stats that's very thoughtful of you I lied I'm all ears well, not literally, of course. Are you sure you want to trust me with that? Okay, she has her own sword. Yeah, I'll, uh... Take a picture of chat. So I can remember. <laughs> command you have inner command state it's your command cancel that let me guess you want to talk huh? isn't there I don't remember what RDO is. To move, I guess. I pressed the thing. What's on your mind? I oh. a little chat. Do I get this? Yeah. 
Oh. What the freak? Okay. I don't know. <laughs> in stealth mode, followers become invisible and muffled to ensure they do not affect the ability or player's ability to sneak. They also will not attack enemies. The invisibility spell will end when you re toggle the setting, drawing your weapon while standing. Player hit actual NPC. So you're the strong silent. I, I have no idea what I'm doing here, but... I bet you must love me talking to you all the time. Transform. Oh yeah, I forgot there's a whole book. <laughs> Dialogue menu, actions, gear, combat, magic, pose, info, settings, powers. Then again... Always glad to help. Can I ask you something? Let's not hang up on the end. Okay. Summon every. Okay, yeah, I. Is this. This has to be for something else. This. I don't think this is for the actual people. Allow targets. Okay, this one has to be that one. Scrum indicates that Sophia is a custom follower is marked for essential in the game. If Sophia is a custom NPC you intentionally install, then you are probably fine. However, if Sophia is not part of the any DLC company you purchase, this would likely break the DLC. What? Is this not what I think it is? Allow targeted NPC to be managed by amazing follower tweaks. Oh yeah, that's not what I think it is. Yeah, but I think there is, let me see. Because this is the Amazing Follower Tweaks book. It says, dialogue menu. And there's, that's basically what I'm trying to get to. But, is it not part of this? I think she might be a whole separate entity. So maybe the thing isn't on her, so maybe I do have to use the thing on her. If it's your first time using this, you may need to dismiss your current follower and ask them to join you again before the speak options will appear. Okay. Okay. Yes, I'm listening. Okay. Part ways. But don't blame me when you get eaten by a saber cat or mauled by a bear. There was something I wanted to ask you. I was kind of hoping you would come back. What is it? Or maybe it's this one. Sure. What's on your mind?
No. <laughs> I do not know. Okay, Whatever. Then. She she should be fighting and stuff. Let me put my spell back. I'll figure it out later. Wait. Huh. Yeah, her, her voice is kind of nasty. I have to agree with that. Where... Oh, she, why is she taking forever? Oh wait, I just, <laughs> cause I run faster. You look strong. Come to your basker. Be a companion. Halt! City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. Open cities mod. Fine. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. <laughs> um we'll pay whatever it takes, but we must have more swords. Here, um Let me just show you this. The Imperial soldiers. Actually I just make a new save. Yeah, I'm gonna delete these. I just can't film Here. Go to the menu. Alright, so... This is the freaking search menu that Xbox has. Looks very garbage. Featured sucks. Literally to find anything. This is the mod I wanted to get, but I don't have freaking AE. So, I can't get this, sadly. Um, these, this is how you have to search for things. This is the guy I'm supposed to be finding for one of my companions. Um, you say I, I have open cities installed, right? If I type in open cities, the mod is not here. Literally looking for one thing, it does not show up. Is a uh, packs for patches and stuff for it, but no matter how much you scroll through this, you will not find the open cities mod. If I go to my library, I forgot what the screen of it looks like. Right there. Oh, of course. It's so inefficient and trash. These are all the mods I have installed. I have one gigabyte space. <laughs> Alright, so let's see. If I type in Gothic, nothing. I mean, there's clothes. Um, that's one result so far, pertaining to Gothic. Yeah, me too. Literally, I don't really use Cursed Forge, but even Cursed Forge would be better than this default. I don't know, oh, a follower. I don't know if you're like looking for like a. Oh, well, true. I don't know if you're looking for like building overhauls or just followers or clothing. And that's the end of the search. Okay. It's, uh, 
I don't even know what you have to look up specifically. Let me see. If I look up followers. I get amazing race tweaks. <laughs> <laughs> and new arrow enhancements. There's a follower pack. Um, let's see, you said, Serana, <laughs> type that in, Serana replacer, blue eyes, no fangs, red eyes, plus fangs, okay, actually showed the mod. Huh, well, that would make sense, but why would there not be a tag for open cities as like a hashtag open cities if it's called open cities? This mod looking thing, uh, this mod downloader system looks like a freaking Sims 3 website. What was the, um, combat mod you were talking about? Why is, why is this a freaking... <laughs> Let me see. I could install this. Punch, kick, jab, and roadhouse. <laughs> Is that zero or that's two B? <laughs> what the freak? You have the fisticuffs mod. I mean, it seems cool, and plus, I would get a bonus. I mean, might as well, I guess. I'll get a bonus, since uh, I'm using Khajiit. I can get bonus hand, uh, hand combat. I don't know if I would want this. I'll, I'll favor it, keep it in mind. This is a huge, requires DLC, 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 previous updates removed. Once again, still, I typed in combat and I'm getting elf textures. <laughs> Improved standing stones.
I think there might be a way, I don't know if it connects to Xbox, but if you go to Bethesda, what's it called, their website, and you log in, and you add a mod to your library, and it pops up here, maybe. I remember somebody said they were looking for open cities forever, and I couldn't find it. And then they, uh, somebody suggested that, and I said thank you. So maybe that works. Kratos follower. Remove to girly animations, remove bow draw speed. <laughs> yeah, this, uh, yeah, unfortunately, you can't like click on their name or anything. I don't think there's a other thing. Hold on. Let me see. Um, typed in their whole author name. Here's a vanilla plus. Action fixes and imperial military camps, modern brawls, mortal enemies. NPCs can run out of arrows slash bolts. NPCs can swim after player. <laughs> NPC don't dodge arrows and spells when player is hidden. Don't use kill moves against player. Run out of magic as fast as player. I'll get it. Hopefully I don't have to reset the thing though. Well, now I don't like that. <laughs>
Yeah. Um. Thunder Child. Twenty nine new shouts with multiple effects. Upload this twice. This is version two. They're both version two. I don't. This one doesn't have everything in this one. I'll just get this one too, I guess. Skyr Tactical Combat. Seems pretty cool. Hopefully, I don't have to reset the playthrough for that. I get the wrong vanilla plus. Are things uploaded twice? This is five point one point one. Okay. It's still crazy to believe that freaking Skyrim is like a one of a kind game because it's like it's newer than Oblivion and stuff. And it hasn't been, nobody's really like taking the mantle of trying to make another Skyrim. And Bethesda's doing Starfield that they've been trying to do for freaking like 14 years.
mask was kind of cool. I have 300 gigabytes, gigabytes of space. Yeah, like, and there might even be one on PC. So I'm be doing like a complete overhaul of the uh, map because there's there's like. So many um maps you can get or extensions. That's a lot of space that I don't have. It's a gigabyte, 1.2. Magical College of Winterhold. Yeah, there's probably someone that's done a, uh... A rehaul of the, uh, map for certain aspects of it, because there's people that's done, um, this. A whole new place. People that's done... This. And this. Should be. How do I use this? Check your inventory. Magical. What is what is magical? In this mod? Oh, yeah, I, I didn't look too good.
150 megabytes. <laughs> Stare into the night sky in first person between 7 p.m. and 7 a.m. <laughs> well, this would just make survival horrible. I remember reading this. This is how far I have to scroll just to find this. There's Dark Ages texture overall. It's not specifically gothic. <laughs> Still can't believe that girl was glitched in the stables like that and she freaking has her freaking boobs are too big. She freaking just is showing through her freaking bikini. I swear it said in the mod that she had clothes on. This game, the looks of it, reminds me of Mountain Blade, Banner Lord. There's that m one mod, Thunder Child. Thirty one new shouts. Recombining words of familiar shouts through meditation. The more shouts you know, the more you can learn. A book and library list all the shouts you can learn. Deal fractional damage or live enemies into a black hole. I'm pretty sure the mod I installed earlier has it in the pack. It says a keyword is moon prints. Let me type that in. Oh my gosh. That was the keyword. Huh.
Well, if that's the case, there should be freaking tags at the very top or the very bottom of the page. With, uh... Say on this, instead of just saying, searched for this keyword, just put in like hashtag, what's it called? Moon prints. You type in hashtag moon prints in the search, and then it just shows you all the hashtag moon prints. But the search in this game is horrible. I wonder if this would break what I have already. Wait, I think I have this already. Yeah. One thing I might get, depending on how good it is, is this farming key. That's kind of odd that they don't. I know there's some mods that are made specifically for special edition or specifically made for Xbox. This farming thing reminds me of a medieval dynasty.
Yeah, that's how I feel about freaking Minecraft mods. For Minecraft, you gotta go to a whole website that is ridden with freaking ads that may be malicious. And then you have to freaking do a whole FTP server and transfer them over from your computer onto your Xbox and then install them. It's, it's a whole process. 